James Kaufman will news report today. Today is December 18th, 2022, 11.30 p.m. Central here in the U.S. God bless you and yours no matter where you are in the world. Please subscribe, give us a thumbs up, ring that bell for critical future updates. Ladies and gentlemen, we've had 26, 27, 28 inflares, all depending on how you count them. Most with associated coronal mass ejections. This has all occurred within the last 72 hours. NASA said that none of these would have an Earth component. All forecasts were nothing. And let's take a look at what really happened on Discover. We got nailed. Just as World News Report Today and James Kaufman said we would. More than newsworthy, Discover Satellite, one hour missing data. It's like we took a jump up here over almost to 40 centimeters cubed. Another jump up here over 41 to 42 centimeters, over 42 centimeters cubed. So the winds have bounced up with the plasma, which is unheard of. We just took a big dip in plasma. Temperatures were elevated. They're very well under control at this moment. However, we just got hit by our first inflow here. You can see it pop up. Started at around 0 hundred, just after 0 hundred UTC time, about 6.30 p.m. Central Time here in the U.S. And then we've just climbed from there into a pretty good hit, 45.15 at one point. Wow. And still no solar weather indication. It wanted to, didn't it? Up top, look at the solar winds being pushed down, as I promised you there would be. Now, we just got hit by our first one. Some will be Earth effective, some will not. And, well, we'll count that as a number one hit of a coronal mass ejection via, i.e., hitting Earth here on December 18th, 2022, just before midnight. God bless you guys. Please share, subscribe. Always remember, anything is possible in Bizarro World.